Friends and family are gathered here today to join Luke and Hannah in marriage. Marriage is not to be entered into lightly, but reverently, discreetly before God. We met in high school and he is just, he's been one adventure after another. He's always my adventure buddy. And I am so excited for this day. Luke and Hannah, you're beginning a new journey on the road of life as you begin your lives together as husband and wife. As you now commit yourselves to one another before God and before your loved ones here today, the vows you take serve to seal you together as one in a way that it has not been until now. They means the world to me. The pathway ahead of you will sometimes be joyful and bright, but there will be times along the way that you will have to strive together to get through some struggles in life. The key word here is together. I charge you here today to commit to always rely on one another and to truly be of one mind as you face life's challenges. <laughs> I charge you to think of one another more highly than yourself, to put your mate's needs above your own. There will be times of disappointments and misunderstandings, but don't let those situations dampen your love for one another. The love and joy you share today will increase many times over as you practice unconditional love for one another. You must both cherish love. Love is a joy, making your eyes light up and sometimes fill up, giving you laughter to uplift your souls. It brings you intense pleasure at the sound of your beloved's voice and at the very touch of a hand or lips sweetly embracing. Lifting you to companionship and meaningfulness. Love is a joy, the richest blessing that you can ever know. Always remember the love and happiness you share today. And when the challenges come into your union, recapture this very moment. And look upon your mate with the same love and joy you feel for one another as you stand here now. The unbroken circle of this ring is a symbol of eternity, of how lasting and imperishable is the faith now mutually pledged by the giving and the receiving of these rings. I, Luke, take you, Hannah, to be my wedded wife. I, Hannah, take you, Luke, to be my wedded husband. To have and to hold. From this day forward. For better or for worse. For richer. For poor. To, to love and to and cherish, cherish till, till death, death do us part. part. I, I give you my love, love and this ring. I, I be wed. wed. As you go down life's pathway together, let love be the charm word in all your relationships. And may the circle of your rings typify your unending happiness. Now let me just say, finally. <laughs> After seven years, you've set the bar high for getting to know someone. Although, I've known Luke for over 20 years. He never asked me to marry him. <laughs> the definition of love, to love is to feel such a strong feeling for another that you can understand them in a way you can. Their very existence is a gift and a treasure, whether they are with you or not. 
The mere thought of them fills you with a deep hope for both the world and yourself. And you both have found that within each other. And today, your journey begins. And I cannot wait to see where life takes you. I've known Luke a long time. During that time, he's changed a lot, but he has always remained a hard worker, a loyal friend, and he always stands up for what is right. This next dance, I would like to dedicate to Mr. and Mrs. Kilber. Uh, thank you guys for letting us share this special day with you. Happy anniversary. These two have been together since high school, and they were both trying to figure themselves out. And with that, they've grown into the man and woman you see here today. Seven years ago, Luke entered our lives. And throughout those years, I saw how much joy and happiness he brought to you. May God bless you and keep you. May God's presence shine on you and be gracious to you. May God's presence be with you and give you peace. <laughs>